That's the name. Shilly Bond here. Welcome if you're new here and welcome back. If you've been here, today I'm reacting to Fast Food Hacks 2 by Shane or Shane Dawson. Um, I reacted to some of his old school stuff, but I decided why not react to some of his new school stuff. Because I'm always looking to see if someone reacted to this because I want someone else to feel what I felt while watching this. So I decided why not be the first. I don't know if I am the first actually. But um, anyway, let's get to it. I have no idea what that is. But yeah. Hello to the guy that's the guy. Today is going up, up, because this is not just a normal Shane makes a bunch of weird food and shoves them down his throat video. This is a Shane makes a bunch of weird food and shoves them down his throat and he has a second angle video. Yes, bitch, that's right. We are taking it up a notch. Yes, we're doing another fast food hack video, but I have this second angle so you can really see the food being built. It's as if you're God and you are watching the world be built and then destroy itself. Also, I'm so excited because this is a celebration, bitch. We have all this food because it's a party. Because I got hashtag spark again. I don't know how this keeps happening. You guys already know this. I literally. Because he's probably like the food sponsors. person. A lot of YouTubers can get sponsors every week, bitch. I get sponsors literally every. Uh, well, when I get a sponsor, it's a very big deal to me. And this sponsor means a lot to me because they were my first hashtag spawn ever. And they came back around to the Shane train. <laughs> Please don't leave. That's right. It's <laughs> Best Fiends, bitch. I considered it. So I just want to say thank you, Best Fiends, for sponsoring this video. In honor of this sponsorship, I had dressed up like a slug. <laughs> just kidding. That's me. So as you guys know, Best Fiends is a free puzzle adventure game where you collect a beat slugs by matching same colored objects. Besides eating, it's the most fun you'll ever have with your fingers. They didn't tell me to say that. That's just the fun. It's like and this month you can they knew that they just knew. And if you beat just all so straight to YouTubers. I've never seen a commercial. I don't watch TV actually. I was gonna say I never saw a commercial this on TV, but yeah, I don't watch TV. <coughs> That's not technically me, but like fucking me. You know what I mean? So I'm gonna put a link right at the top of the description. Click it, and you will download the game for free. And if you click that link and download it, you'll get $4.99 in free gold and diamonds. And once again, I just want to say thank you to Best Fiends, guys. Please go download the game. I know you probably already have it, but if you don't get it, and they have sponsored me like twice now or three times, I might get it. And I might. People very rarely want me near their brand. <laughs> so thank you, Best Fiends. Let's eat. <laughs> okay, so I have decided to combine two of my favorite things. We are going to be taking foods from Taco Bell and foods from Pizza Hut and combining them and making some fucked up shit. <laughs> like some shit that you have to not just be high for, but you got to like drink pain. Like, I need you on another dimension to fuck with this food. So first, we're going to be combining a pepperoni pizza and a Crunchwrap Supreme. Bitch, I'm going there. I'm oh, not really God, that I'm much so of a Taco excited. Bell person. Like, I love tacos and uh, Pizza Hut, so let's see what's happening here. It's like tacos are like the only real thing I've had from Taco Bell. I never really, like, dove in. <clears throat> it's just that I have that fear of buying a food and I don't like it and I waste my money on it. So I'll just take a bite of someone else's. I'm not a pepperoni girl. I don't like that. I don't like. I don't like seeing pizza bent like that. Uh, okay, yes. <laughs> this is amazing, and I want to put my face in. But first, we're gonna take our crunch wrap and unwrap her as well. Oh my God! Look how beautiful she is. Uh, I love couples where it's like one small girl, but big old bitch, which is every relationship I've ever been in. <laughs> and which one were you? Yeah, I'm a huge bitch. Okay, so first we are going to. Unwrap it's like those are the only two relationships he's been in. Oh my God. Oh, that's like, mm, how is not going to get to like that's actually kind of sad. a room full of like cute little elves and they're wrapping up the crunch wrap and they have like Christmas music playing. But in reality, it's like two angry high school graduates who see me walk up and they're like, that motherfucker's back again. <laughs> we already gave you all the cheese, Shane. Yeah, they love me there. Uh, okay, now that this is unwrapped, what we're going to do is take one of our pieces of pizza. Oh my God. And we are just going to remove her from her crust. Wish someone would remove me from my crust. <laughs> Unfortunately, psoriasis is tough to get rid of. All right, so we're it's gonna like, why don't you like oh, just <laughs> we're gonna take some unwrap it and then keep the pizza and then just cut those crunch wrap supreme and then it's like 
slice of the supreme and the pizza. But, you know, I don't know. Let's see. He did this one thing one time where he had these little, um, um, circle pieces and he put them all in a pan and it was like a pizza cake. Oh my god. Mm. So loud. Does he have oh, viewers? Okay, the slugs and your headphones. Uh, no, this is incredible. I can't even explain it here. I feel like we need to like really cut her in half so you can see. Oh, the pizza, the fucking innards. Oh, yeah, the innards. Like he's just tearing that supreme oh, apart. If you want ASMR diarrhea? That'll be on my second channel. <laughs> is that a thing? Oh my god, that's probably a thing. I can just imagine. I think that might be a thing, but it's not on YouTube, it's on like the dark internet, you know what I mean? There's probably a fetish for it. cheese on top of that that's normal nachos bitch sit down we are going to be taking <coughs> tops of pizza and using it as nacho toppings oh my god yes just scrape off all remember when i was in school we had those rectangle oh pizzas you know i'm talking about oh i used to just peel off the cheese and eat it and then i would fold the pizza and eat it like that oh that's gonna be so good so now that we have our pepperonis and our cheese we are going to add something a little bit different bitch she brought pasta so i feel like this might uh really clap that's kind of and that's extra don't put your fingers in it like that. Oh my god, <laughs> the creaminess of it all. Me when I'm on RuPaul's Drag Race. So Ru, how do I look? <gasps> the creaminess of it all. Yeah, it's not good. My drag name would be... Great, that was like a top-notch top impression. Okay, so now that we have the pasta, we're going to be adding more marinara sauce. <clears throat> oh my god. Oh, bitch. This, this is everything. They need to add this on the menu because Taco Bell and Pizza Hut are sometimes together. Why don't they get together and have some beautiful babies? I mean, some will be mistakes. Like, nobody wants beans on their pizza. But some will look like this. <laughs> yeah, never mind. Okay, so the grand finale, we are going to dust on some grated Parmesan cheese. Oh, my God. Oh, and there you have it. Our pachachos. Uh, these look amazing. When did I become a chef? I'm a slime maker. I'm I a feel chef. like maybe he should have put, like, the pasta right, and the cheese. pizza top oh <clears throat> and the pizza toppings <laughs> into a bowl. Oh Microwave them to make them all mushy and saucy, and then sprinkle them on the nachos or dip them. I think that would have been like, yeah. It's like my tips on how you can do better. This is insane. This, this is a baby I like. This is a baby who shuts the fuck up. This is a baby who doesn't judge me with her eye. This is a baby I'm not afraid to get naked in front of. This is a baby I don't leave around my dog hoping it'll attack. This is incredible. I love this. Pizza Hut, Taco Bell. Hi. I'm Shane, your biggest nightmare. Can you guys add this to the menu and call it the Shane? I get an email from Taco Bell. Hi, Shane. We reject <laughs> this offer. We actually threw up while watching your video. You are fucking gross. Goodbye. <laughs> Okay, now this next one I actually think is gonna be great. You know, if I had a food company, I would definitely sponsor Shane to do my stuff because I mean, like, that's just like, I mean, that's common and it's also like because he has a bunch of people who watch him try all kinds of foods. If you sponsor him, then then he likes to eat food. Oh my god! When did this turn into a dissection video? Oh my god! That looks like it had. That's disgusting. How we can eat that? It's like I don't want to see how it's made. I just want to see the pretty box that came. We are going to add our new ingredient: fried chicken nuggets. 
Now I know. This seems crazy, but don't worry. It's gonna get worse. I'm so hungry. We are going to be adding. Oh God. Some I'm so sleepy. It's three o'clock in the afternoon right now, and I only woke up an hour, like two hours ago. So that means I only woke up at one o'clock in the afternoon, and I'm still tired. I don't like pizza with all that stuff on it. Like I just want my cheese and my sausage. That's all I want. Maybe some cheese and a crust. I don't know. Oh is it just sauce that goes on buffalo wings? Or is there something buffalo sauce? If you understand what I meant, you know. Oh wow. This looks great. It doesn't at all look like your uncle died when he I feel like when he bites into that's gonna be extra messy. Yeah, that's not what it looks like at all. Um okay, well here it is. Uncle Jim. Alright, let's give this bite. You know what? I'm gonna go uh in the middle. I just love Uncle Jim's midsection. All right, here we go. <laughs> Uncle Jim! <laughs> I never knew. If I'd have known you were this good, I would have eaten you years ago. Uh, no, this is actually really fucking good. Like the layer. I guess that helps date it from the middle. I remember in school we used to get like the little. What is that called? Whatever, we're gonna get the wrap, and then we used to get the stuff that goes in the wrap. Like, we had the choices of which meat we wanted in the wrap. And then I would always try to articulate the perfect wrap, you know, but I could never. So I just held one end and bit one, and then just hoped for the best. And then whatever fell out, I scooped it back in. The waste food. That's my sister. I never had those, but I, f I feel like they'd be good. Now my dad, he got, he has the bags that he gets from the store, and like he eats those so quickly. So do all my cousins, but I know I don't like them. Either, either, at either. It's like a mom. She went to miss something original for the bake sale. That's too much. That's too much. The diabe Oh, he should call his his people like the diabetics. That'd be hilarious. I feel like he should like put it in something like a crust or something just to make it look presentable. Presentation is key. Just get a really big spoon and just. Exactly. Hmm. See, the world balances out. See, now this is perfect. 
Learn that as a lesson, guys. When something is wrong in your life, just get a different type of fruit. The more food, the less problems. More food, less problems. Me when I run a rehab and I kill everybody. <laughs> Uh, no, that was it. I don't know what else to do. I am gonna leave. You did. The <laughs> journey to killing yourself with food. I'm proud that we're both alive, but just know that if I do die, like, soon, she's broken. So drama channels, get ready. Put this murderer in your thumbnail. Shane Dawson was murdered? Death by food. When the food video turns to a death video. Uh, no, this is amazing. I had a lot of fun. <laughs> Thank you, Best Fiends, for sponsoring me. I'm sorry. Guys, hey, please download the game. I'll put the link right there at the top of the description. Please click it, download it, it's free. And if you want more videos where I do very, very weird, fucked up shit like this, give me a thumbs up so I know. Also, make sure to subscribe to my channel right down below and hit that notification bell because I make good videos every day. And if you want to see my last fast food hack video where I took uh, crazy Jack in the Box items and made them crazier, then I'll put a link to that right there too. Alright, you guys, I will see you, little dessert nacho. Ugh, um, okay, so that was Shane Dawson, Fast Food Hacks 2. Um, no, okay, so that's just a lot. I wish I had enough money to buy that food and just mess it up. Actually, I don't, because that would be bad for me, people involved. Um, but no, okay, so, if you guys like this, I'm gonna keep reacting to his stuff, not just his conspiracy theories or stuff like that, but more like his just food hacks. See, I'm a YouTube -y to be a youtuber like i'm one of those i believe you may be one of those who just sits at home and watches youtubers just do a bunch of stuff and then i like to see someone like i look up if anyone reacted to this and no one has so i decided why not be the first um but yeah if you guys like this i'll keep it up and um also um yeah i'm writing some of all some old school shane dawson stuff on my channel you should check that out if you're not familiar with old school shane dawson please Go check it out, please, because you need to see it. You need to see what he was, so you can really connect. So you can really connect with who he is. Um, but yeah, okay. So that's all. <clears throat> I will link Shane's channel in the description below and this original video. If you're not familiar with Shane Nelson, who are you? But also, if you like me reacting to stuff, please subscribe to my channel, Shnilly Vaughn, and follow me on Instagram and Facebook and Twitter at Alien Lady Kisses. And until next time, bye!